coming back from my injury and everything like that, I've basically just taken it one day at a time. It's been a very long recovery, so just getting back into it, it's taken me a while and longer than I wanted it to, but I stayed patient with the process and thankfully, you know, God helped me get through it and then to this point where I am now, I'm feeling comfortable and confident and yeah, just perfect timing, I guess. For a player who couldn't seem to get to break in her first two seasons at Quincy University, Lucy Cramsey has shown an inexplicable flair for good timing of late. She's playing the best basketball of her brief collegiate career at the most critical juncture of the Lady Hawks season. See also last night's career best 25 point, seven three pointer effort against Lewis. And in the process, filling the critical minutes contributions this team hadn't been able to recover in Daryl Goldie's concussion related absence. This season, um, you know, I started off a little rough and, you know, Although what happened to Daryl, it stinks, but then I came in and I said, hey, I got to help our team out as much as I can because she was a great part of our team and so that's all I did. I think as the season progressed, her knee has felt a little, she's felt a little bit more comfortable because, you know, sitting out a whole year um, takes, takes a toll and it takes some time for her to get back into it. Um, even though she's, you know, been 100% in rehab and it takes a little time to get back into the game. Uh, I think lately she's really felt comfortable with it. Um, really accepted her role and come on strong and, and lets the game come to her. And maybe that is the silver lining and all that Lucy has battled to get back to this point. Anyone who saw her play at Liberty High School would attest Lucy was a phenomenal virtuoso solo act. The limitations put on her by the knee injury, however, forced her to rethink her game in a way that ultimately might make her a more productive cog in this ensemble cast. I couldn't do some of the things that I'm used to doing and what I did in the past, so I mentally had to get over that obstacle and just say, hey, you can become a different player and you can work at this aspect of the game and that's what helped me get through it a lot. We need her to, to score a little bit um, and and help us in that uh, that aspect. You know, we have uh, hopefully four to five people in double digits every game and, and that's what we got to keep up and, and she's one of those key components, you know, a balanced scoring attack. Um, and the other thing is her defense. We got to have we put her on usually on the, one of the toughest players on the opposing team, and, and she's uh, got to come out and play tough defense and limit their touches. So she's exerting a lot of energy out there. Um, and then you know she plays back up point for us also. So she's a, a key part for multiple positions, and she's very versatile. It's huge to me. You know, I went through a lot of emotional pain in the past. Just. In my first two years, it was very rough, and being a part of the team is awesome now. And I'm very happy and thankful for it, and I just pray that we can take this opportunity and do something amazing with it.